Hey guys, and welcome back to another episode of the 100 Vampire Baby Challenge. So as you guys know, last episode, Zara finally aged up, which I was so happy about, and she's so pretty, and I can't even get over that, and Angelique gave birth in last episode to a baby girl named Luna, and honestly, I'm still shocked that she only had one child. I expected her to have at least twins, but I guess that's... That was not in the books for her. I mean, hopefully she has twins next time. I, I don't know why I'm hoping for that, but I kind of want to get her to have more kids. The main thing I want the kids to work on is their skills because, again, I want them to um, be able to age up. What I think I'm going to do is try and get Angelique to um, get to know somebody else uh, because we, um, we, I want to have somebody on the back burner, of course, when um, she is not pregnant anymore. Um, so, let's see, who have we already been with? So, we've been with, how many guys? I think five. Oh. Have we really been with seven? One, two, three, four, five, six. We've already, oh no, we've only been with, never no, just kidding. We've only been with six. So, Marcus, we're, Marcus, we're not dealing with you right now. Um, I think we're gonna go ahead and I think I might go for Baco. Or, oh wait, no, Jay. I want Jay. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna go ahead and tell Terrell to go home. We're gonna tell him goodbye, you did your job, and now we're gonna ask him to leave. It is 9 p.m. Oh no, Luna's crying. Luna, it's okay, mama's coming. Feed her, bottle feed. And then after that, she can go ahead and invite Jay, uh, and hopefully things will go well, I hope. Um, I should probably not, I should probably just invite him over and not chat because I don't think that'll help. Alright, let's see. What do you need? Okay, you need sleep. Okay, did you do your homework? You better have. Oh, you can do extra credit. Go do extra credit. I mean, might as well. Finish extra credit. Alright, did you do your homework? Uh, do extra credit work. I'd laugh if these guys, like, left the house tomorrow or if they were to age up tomorrow. Oh my god. I don't want them to, but at the same time, it'd be pretty crazy because then we'd only have, we'd have, we only have three kids in the house. That'd be crazy. Okay, so he's already leveled up his skill and he has excellent performance in school. And then Zane also is excellent, but we need to get his skill up to level three. So we could probably work on trying, oh, he's almost there. Okay, this will be a breeze. Oh, she's still crying. Luna, honey. Change her diaper. Aww. I'm so glad we have another daughter. I wonder what she's gonna look like. I feel so weird not having that many kids around right now. Oh my god, this is so weird. Like, only Draco's the only one. And I think he's gonna be aging up soon as well. I believe he would be. Um, yeah, it's very likely that he could. So, okay. So Jay should be here soon. Alright, he's here. Alright, let's go ahead and say hello to him let's greet him all the romance is gonna be really awkward because he's taller than her so like when they kiss she's gonna be kissing his neck and stuff which i mean is okay but <laughs> okay i'm just gonna i'm just gonna get to know him and stuff and we can also beguile him already but we'll just you know do our thing oh wait let's not kiss his hand yet let's not go too far he's so much taller I'm gonna have to get rid of height sliders after I do my Hunger Games series, but um, for now, it's still in, and then after that, they'll be out. I just thought it was cute to do height sliders. I just wish the interactions were, like, the same. Do you have homework to do? Do extra credit. Where is he going? What? Excuse- Jay! What? Honey, no, you're not. Angelique, get out here and talk to him. Why did you want to run away from us? Excuse you. Look at the way he's standing. Alright, let's chat with him. Why are you st- Oh my, this is so weird. Oh, they already- How is the relationship so good already? What? I don't know. Anyway. Oh, just, you can describe aesthetics. That's so cool. All right, we're going to romance him. Actually, let's beguile. And uh, let's just get into it. Why, sh why don't we? Um, I was thinking about moving out this episode, but I think I'm going to hold off. Who's pregnant? 
Oh my god, look at these outfits. Can you believe this? Who's that? Sheila Amaya. Oh my god, I feel like I never see pregnant sims, but now that I have story progression, I feel like it happens a lot more. Did she just walk around? Okay. Oh, he's feeling flirty. Good. Okay, exchange numbers. And we're gonna do our first kiss because why not? <gasps> Look at it's Leona! Leona! It's so weird seeing her actually like walk around the town. <gasps> oh my god, that's so strange. Okay, anyway. Oh, she kissed his neck! <laughs> oh. oh no, she's feeling sick from the baby. Alright, are you low on thirst? Yeah, you are. Oh, you're taking a bath right now. Alright, well, after you do that, okay, so Angelique, oh, he's, oh, he came into our house, oh, that's where he went, okay, honey, alright, well, you need to drink up, because you're drinking for two, again, or however many babies are in there, because last time I thought there was more, but apparently there was only one. Oh, you don't have any plasma in your inventory, hold up, mama's gonna hook you up, just a second, and we can go ahead and have her, I guess, wait, is she trolling the forums? Yeah, I guess that's what she wants to do. I thought it was so funny that her aspiration is to be a good vampire, but one of her traits is evil. I was like, that doesn't make any sense, but I mean, if that's the way uh, it's gonna go, I guess it is. Like, I'm also, I don't know how, go, how to go about this, because if I want Zara to be my heir, do I not have her age up as soon as she gets an A and just have her be a full length teen? I don't know. I feel like I should just keep her a teen for the full length. Unless like Angelique becomes Grandmaster sooner than expected, then maybe. Oh, his social's really low. I guess you could talk to him about some, I guess, life stuff. I don't know. Oh, is he gonna go for a jog? Oh, and he's taking a bath. Oh, bye Jay. Thanks for stopping by. We'll, we'll be calling ya in the next, I don't know, three to four days. Oh, did he just disappear? Okay, honey. Oh, Zara's just playing basketball. Okay. I thought this outfit was kind of cute. I was like, I gave her a, her a simple outfit, but I really like this shirt with the little cat. I do what I want. Anyway, I'm gonna go ahead and have her, hmm, we should probably have her do some research for, um, to reach towards Master Vampire. Where are they going? Oh. What is she doing? Chat with Orion. Oh, they're gonna take a picture together. Aww, so cute. It's going up slightly. I don't want her to like, I'm just, I don't want her to age up just as of yet or like leave the house. I don't know. I'm still like trying to figure out how I want everything to play out, but I think things will go well, hopefully. Angelique has exhausted all information on vampires that she can find online. She wants to learn more, she should order some vampire books on the computer. We've already ordered all of them and we already pretty much know everything with, about them. What are these guys doing? Oh, this is so cute. They're all just hanging out with each other. Oh, as, as Zara's running away. Okay, never mind. That's so cute though. So I guess, and he is level three. Okay, we're gonna go ahead and have um, Zane come over here. Wait, no, just before you do that, go drink. And then we can have him practice writing because he's almost there i believe um yeah he's literally almost there oh luna's awake hi baby girl look at you and your paintings sell so, really that only cost 200 okay this is why we don't paint anything but classic or abstract because for some reason they just yeah see every time she looks up vampire um stuff online she gets bored of it really quickly because she knows so much so i guess it's, i think it's gonna be a little bit harder to level up in that case because she knows so much about it all right you can go ahead and shower and then i guess we could probably oh he reached level three cool so he's all set to age up um oh wait we could actually have him fish with bait hold on let's get some plasma fruit in his inventory uh, and maybe he'll catch some bigger fish for us before he leaves us. Well, if he does leave us um, this episode. Which I would assume um, Zane and Orion will, but... Who's, oh, who's Zane gonna live with? I might have him move in with um, Orion's father. Just so that they're together, since like they're the only older brothers at the moment i could move him into a house alone and then i could have all the kids start moving in there because there is an empty house um right here this empty house i could have them move here uh so i don't know hmm 
If anything, I can always switch where they live, so it doesn't even matter, really. Okay, Angelique, you need to go up, take care of Luna. Oh no, Zara's already going for it. Never mind. Bottle feed. Okay, you can continue painting in that case. Never mind. I, I forget that we have teas that can help now. Aw, you're such a nice sister. Aw, Zara. And, uh, yeah. Alright. Did you already finish? She's literally a pro painter. Okay, 829. That's better than nothing. Well, that's better than 200. Yeah, we, look at the money, all the money we have. We might be able to move out next episode, I think. What do you guys think? Should I move out? I think it'll be about time. I'm gonna feel bad leaving this house, but I mean, like, I think it's time. Oh, we need to get her to work on our garden, actually. It's starting to die a bit. <laughs> Can't neglect it fully. Oh, and we can f harvest. Okay, forget about painting. Come on, harvest all of this. Um, you know, I'm gonna go ahead and sell this. Since we have a lot. Oh, wait, they start school in an hour? Oh my god, I didn't even realize. Alright, he at least caught one fish before he's heading off to school. So we're gonna have him stop that and let's grab that fish and put it in our inventory. We have so many, like... I feel like I should have more plants, but at the same time, if we move out, there's, I feel like there's no point in growing a bigger garden here. I kind of want to get a cow plant, but I don't know where you have to go fishing to get one. I feel like somebody said something about that in the comments at one point, but I can't remember where it was. Or maybe it was on a different series. I can't even remember at this point, but I remember somebody told me where I could get, where I could fish for one, but... All right, we got $5 for Zane's books. Okay. Um, I guess I could have Angelique go fishing. Since she has, I mean, I could have her paint to get money, but I kind of just want to get her to get more plasma packs for the kids. Hopefully Angelique catches some fish before the kids come home. And she's using bait as well, so let's hope. <gasps> George is calling to go on a date. Sorry, George, but we're gonna have to decline. Oh, she's already thirsty. Oh my goodness. Oh, Luna's awake. Angelique, time to go home. No time. Let's have her fly here as a bat. Thankfully, we have that option, because it doesn't take as long. All right, the kids should be home from school very shortly. Sorry. Oh, it's Friday. I didn't even realize it was Friday. <gasps> Zayton's an A student. Orion's an A student. And Draco's an A student. Okay. That means, okay, so I was right. They are aging up today. Oh my god, there are three birthdays. <gasps> and two are moving out. Oh my god, there's only going to be four of us in the house. <gasps> oh my god, that's gonna. we haven't had that many in like so long. Okay, actually I'm going to go ahead and have, oh wait, before you do that, go ahead and drink and then we can go ahead and have you make the cake for the boys. Oh my god, all three boys are aging up. Holy. All right, Zara. Oh my god, she's going to be the, oh wait, no, because Draco's being a teen as well. Well, Luna's probably going to be a teen, I mean, a toddler soon. So, it's not going to be too long from now. It's actually, it might take a while because Zara's never made a cake before. So, we'll have to just wait and see. Hopefully, no fires start. As she thinks about a fire. I literally just said, hopefully, no fires start and a fire just start. Oh, my God. Extinguish. Oh, Oh my god, no! We have to get a new stove now! Okay, Angelique, she got it. Oh my god. We got 420, okay. Oh, it's 1,050. Okay, we need a stove, so might as well. My god, okay. Draco, we're gonna have you be the first one to age up this time. And then we'll have the boys okay you don't need to run come go put the candles on and age up come on draco let's go Ooh, yeah. <laughs> his aspiration is a big happy family his trait is evil oh my god why are all my sims getting this like the same traits come on all right so his last trait is going to be gloomy, right? Add birthday candles. Oh, I've never seen them sing happy birthday. What? That's so cool. Okay. And time for you to age up. Come on down. 
Leona Dever is wondering if I want to go over. No, honey, no. His last trade is going to be genius. All right. So it's time for him to. Oh my god, it's time for the boys to move out. So Orion and Zane are going to be moving in with Vlad. Oh my god, it's so crazy how much alike they look, but. All right. Well, this is our household now. That's so crazy. So this is what Draco looks like. I wanted to go ahead and kind of give him a, I guess, nerdy but stylish vibe. Um, I don't know. I really like the way he looks and I absolutely love those sneakers from City Living. And I'm just, I don't know. I'm really excited. Like it, I'm, it just feels really weird that I only have four Sims right now in this house and one's a baby and I can only play with three now. Not that I could do so much with anybody else, but like, I don't know, it's so weird. I'm gonna go ahead and have- oh, she's feeling- touching her baby belly. Her touching her baby belly? That too. I'm gonna go ahead and have her, uh, practice dribbling. I guess we could go ahead and have them all practice. You could go ahead and play with them too. Just shoot around. See, like, I don't even know what to do anymore. I need Draco to- I need, I'm gonna need them to do homework, of course. Oh, he caught- did he catch this book or did he get it? I have no idea. Maybe he started reading it. Who's calling? <gasps> Jay. Every time I go on dates, I, it's never lucky. I always end up getting ditched. So you know what? Forget it. We're not going to go on a date. He's just dribbling over here. Why don't you shoot around, bud? Did I say practice dribbling? I meant shoot around. Is she practice dribbling? It's almost Luna's birthday. Oh my god, I'm so excited. Wait. Wait. You need to drink. Actually, before you continue shooting, drink. I want to wait until she gets her belly, but I think it's... Oh, it's in two hours. Okay. I just want to see her belly, and then I'm probably going to end off the episode. Uh, I just need more children in this house now. It feels so empty. <laughs> Come on, guys. I wish they could, like, play a game together. Can't they? This is so cute. I'm glad that they added this. Like, I kind of... If you guys, if any of you guys play The Sims 2, they had this, um, The Sims 2, what was it, Free Play? No, The Sims 2 Free Time. That was one of my favorite packs because you could do so many things like ballet. I don't know, I, I feel like there should be more activities for Sims to do together even. Um, but I guess we'll just, oh, is she really stinky? Yeah, okay, we're gonna go ahead and have her take a bath because we don't want her to be smelling. Okay, seven minutes, she's gonna get her bump. I'm gonna wait as she does her random tricks and stuff. I've actually never seen the sim actually get their belly. I'm waiting. Oh! It just happened just like that. Oh my god, that's the first time I've ever actually seen a belly pop like that. I remember I loved the way the sims got their bellies in Sims 2. It would like zoom in on them and then they would like... It would, like, make a boing sound or something like that. I can't even remember completely, but I loved the pregnancies in Sims 2. Uh, but, yeah, that's all I have for this episode. There's not much else. Thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to subscribe if you aren't already. Give this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. And I'll talk to you guys in a new video very soon. Bye, guys.